Only on two at 10 o'clock tonight, targeted by thieves, an 87-year-old woman loses her jewelry and her life savings during a break-in. They're using people's kindness and their willingness to help a neighbor in order to rob them blind. The suspects used a heartbreaking tactic to get what they wanted. Now, one of these guys posed as the victim's neighbor asking for help, while the other one snuck in and out of the home undetected. Good evening, I'm Bill Baessa. Hello, I'm Dominique Soxa. It really is one of those infuriating stories of people just taking advantage of somebody else's kindness. Our Keith Garvin spoke with the victim's daughter and joins us live right outside their home in Northwest Houston tonight. Keith? Dominique, Bill, the 87-year-old victim has been in this neighborhood now for several decades, and everyone says that she's been always very kind to neighbors and even animals who needed help. But investigators say a couple has taken advantage of that kindness and now left her in a very difficult spot. It's heartbreaking and, and horrendous. I mean, what kind of monster targets an 87-year-old woman? Many would say monsters is the proper word for the couple who targeted 87-year-old Vivian Sundermeyer. A man and woman used a ruse to break into Sundermeyer's home in Northwest Houston and steal not only her jewelry, but her life savings in cash. It's been a time getting over it, just thinking that people are that ugly. Just, they don't care what they leave, how bad it leaves you, and what a position you left in. Because I can't get out and work anymore like I used to. Sundermeyer says about a month ago, a woman came by the home with a man she claimed was her husband. They were new to the area and wanted to meet neighbors, they said. They came back a few days later, and the woman lured Mrs. Sundermeyer out of her home by claiming she had car trouble. One time when she was here, the man, um, said that he had to go back home and headed back the other direction and what we think he did is jump the fence here and break into a side door that was out of view. Sundermeyer and her daughter eventually discovered almost all her jewelry was stolen and even worse an entire safe that contained her life savings and cash. And now the woman who has helped so many people and rescue animals get back on their feet is hoping someone will do the same for her. She's helped a lot of people and a lot of animals over the years and and it's just very frustrating that, that someone would come and, and use that kindness against her. It's very discouraging. I just hope that something can be done. Yeah, well, the family certainly hopes that those thieves are caught, so they're asking anyone with any information about the thieves to call HPD. We have put a description of their SUV on our website. The family has also set up a GoFundMe account to try and help Mrs. Sundermeyer recover at least some of her life savings. We have a link to that GoFundMe on our website, clicktohouston.com, as well. Reporting live in Northwest Houston, Keith Garvin, KPRC Channel 2 News.